Don't enter a relationship until you do these seven things. If you want your relationship to last, you have to make sure that you're 100% ready to take on a girlfriend's responsibilities. The fate of the relationship can't all fall on your man's shoulders. Even if you two are perfect for each other, you won't be able to survive as a couple until you're both ready to be in a committed relationship. In order for that to happen, here are a few hash things that you should do before you enter a relationship. 1. Know how to take care of yourself. Happy couples are willing and able to take care of each other. However, you shouldn't enter a hash relationship before you're capable of taking care of yourself. If you don't have enough hash money to support yourself, or if you struggle to do your own laundry, then you'll end up relying on your man to do it all for you. That's unhealthy thinking because if you two end up breaking, you'll be left without the skills to survive. 2. Get closer with your exes. Do your hash crush a favor by waiting to get into a relationship with him. You shouldn't agree to date him until you're completely over all of your exes. If you're still hung up on someone else, then the problems you had with an hash ex could cause problems in your new relationship. You need to close that door before you open a new one. 3. Establish standards. Once you fall for someone, it's hard to say goodbye to them even if you know they're unhealthy for you. That's why it's important to establish standards before you enter a hash relationship. Figure out where you draw the line when it comes to how a hash man should treat you. That way, after you start dating someone and they cross that line, you'll know you need to end it. The lines won't be blurry because you already established them before you met him. 4. Find friends to hang out with. You don't want your hash partner to become your entire life. You should have other hash people to hang out with, whether they're your close friends or cousins. Just make sure you have a social circle that extends beyond your hash boyfriend and his buddies. 5. Learn how to handle confrontation. You can't be afraid to tell your boyfriend that he made you mad. You can't yell and scream before storming off every single hash time that he makes you mad, either. It's important for you to learn how to handle confrontation before you get a hash boyfriend so that you don't end up getting walked on or pushing him away. 6. Know what you want in life. Don't let your hash man shape your future. If he wants kids, but you don't, then you're allowed to speak your mind about the matter. Since it's hard to stop your man's opinion from bleeding into yours, you should figure out what you want from life before you enter a hash relationship. That way, you'll be able to tell him where you stand from the get-go. 7. Become comfortable with your body. It's important for you to learn to be comfortable with your own body before you let another person start hugging and kissing. If you aren't, then your self-consciousness could cause you to shy away from hash affection. So do your best to learn to love yourself. If you want to have a long, healthy hash relationship, you should make it your mission to do all of these things. Have you checked off all the hash things on this list?